beat the conference champions Northwestern State and they're trying to have a, a six win season and which would be an amazing uh, story based on what happened in August. Truly an amazing turnaround and Jay Thomas deserves a whole lot of credit. He can become the first Nickel State head coach ever to have a winning record he is in also his first year. for five touchdowns but this is a team that will keep the ball on the ground primarily with running the backs triple are option. David Playson. Now Colt Coletti normally would be in there but he's injured. Had a neck stinger last week. He will not play tonight. Broderick Cole is the fullback. The other tailback will either be Joseph Robbins or Joel Fahmede. They'll rotate. The offensive line. Jacob Bender. Benjamin Gambazzi. Cody Stogner, Jake Huzen. Yale Benoit will run and the triple option. He'll end up to the big fullback. That's the freshman Cole still on his feet to the 20-yard line. He loves contact, does Broderick Cole. Big right gain side, on that Houston, carry. The right guard, Trostclair, the right tackle. Just, uh, just really dominate the defensive line there. That's just a handoff dive to the fullback that almost went for a score. So the Colonels, you know, why not? Tenth game of the year. You're not playing for anything but a winning season. The four Showing carries, Broderick Cole, the... three carries, 31 yards. This is the pitch back and running room on the near sideline, just barely stepping out of bounds. Joseph well, Robbins. Play an option team. You really got to watch where the ball is. Kind of lines up in the wing back spot and comes in motion and just does step out of bounds right there with that left foot and the right By just Jay good Jones. Measure, Jones, six of seven on the year. And make it seven out of eight as he makes it from the right hash get mark. 20 points. They're five and zero oh on the year when they score 20 or more. So that's a, a key number to watch as the, as the night. For Nicholas and 20 is only defensively. Michael Young, Shane Flybert, Trey Robertson, and Brian Pyle. Your front four: Lavincio Brown, Corey Bavala leads the team in tackles. Rogers Williams so brings the line. team to the line of scrimmage. First and ten. This is Chris Thomas, and he is absolutely wrestled down. The ball Let is Chris loose. Thomas. His hands as soon as he was hit, and the fumble is recovered by Nickel State. Colonels football you know, Nickel State on the turnover. Came into this game tied for the conference lead in turnover ratio, as you mentioned, plus eight now, plus nine. And that's really impressive considering this game the triple option. the first team. quarter, and again, the turnover problem continuing to play. McNeese State. Here's the handoff to the freshman Robbins. Robbins Better having a good first quarter. Here is Thomas again. This time he's wrapped up behind the line of scrimmage coming in with the big hit for Nickel State is 43, Lavincio Brown. This is Thomas on the delayed handoff. Gets hammered after a short gain. Big hit made by the middle of that Colonel's defensive. Need to hold him. He's going to get all the way inside the five anyway. Here's the handoff to Franklin, and Lavincio Brown is right there. This guy's got amazing speed from the linebacker position. A big loss on third and long. And he just, once he gets his hands on you, that's it. You're going down. So it'll set up a field goal attempt Nickel for one State of the best. over two in passing. Every yard they've gained has been on the ground with a triple option. This time, Vinoy keeps it for a while. Now pitches back to Playson. Playson buries his shoulder, stays on his feet before he is upended on a great tackle by Travis. Out of the LSU transfer, but what a nice job by Vanoy. Right as he's about to get hit and go down, pitches it to Playson, who kept the, the perfect distance from the quarterback and breaks two tackles as he cuts back. Travis Moses gets a handle of him, and I think it looked worse than it was. But uh, he's happy, and so are the Colonels. Conference after that title big run. had they won last week at Texas State. But they got down big in that game. Lost 35 14. Yale Benoit. Because it looks like Cole's got it, and so did the, the Cowboys thought he did. Two defenders tried to tackle him, but right at the last second. Benoit. 27 yard line. Benoit back to throw. He changes field and right here. It looks like it's going to be a. A big play. The fullback Cole's got it. Quad receivers, a lone setback. Pendarvis back to throw, and the pass is knocked down. Good defensive play by Nick Nichols. Well, now State, they're just trying to get a win, but a little sky action right there on each side. Nice play by him. No tight ends. Quad receivers. This is the leading receiver, and he is tackled behind the line of scrimmage. Another fine play by Henry Johnson. He batted the pass down. towards the sideline. He'll he'll be dragged out of bounds. Been a house of fire ever since. And Thomas, this time they will go away. 
The ones that were here for the last three seasons with three. This is carry number 22. Slips a little bit, loses momentum. A flag goes in and, and caught down for the left, uh, left sidelines and ball right and here, defender get tucked away. Two hands on it. Uh, almost impossible to fumble, but that's the kind of year it's been for McNeese State. What a first half for Lavincio Brown. Here he takes a swing pass and he gets hit hard. Oh, Able to put the cleats down and pick out up the about shotgun six gun extra yards. Pendarvis. Scott Pendarvis throws over the middle. Man, we haven't called his name in a little while. He had a good first quarter, and he is their go-to guy. That is a tough kick. You know you're going to pay the price going across the middle, and not afraid. Go. Chris Thomas is slammed to the turf. Big hit. Pass complete, getting upended. But good crack back block by one of his receivers. Andy Bertrand, the senior. Transfer from North Carolina a lot State of wounds this year. They had just given up 50, 50 or more in three consecutive games. Here's the first pass play resulting in any. It was a. The quarterback situation where Chris Jones comes in for a series in third in the third quarter like he did in the second this one he keeps himself this will be jones up the middle himself he needs to get to the 29 he fumbles the football and nickel state recovers it's lavincio brown on one the recovery of right here once again jones looks like he's got the first gets stripped as he's going down and then if you're nickel state the right guy got the fumble lavincio brown now, he, quite he can a run with for it. these colonels out of nickel state but now let's see if Nickel State can do anything offensively. It's the reverse to the wide receiver. He is down the middle of the field. Marcus Richardson into the end zone. Play right touchdown. after the fumble. Nickel State, the head wasn't in it. Can't quite. They're 16. Game they, they, after taking over with the fumble from the 24. Benoit pitches back to Playsons. He gets a good block, but then Playsons is tripped up. At good job. Right here in the pitch, Playson looks up. Right of your screen, you see that Cowboy DD on the ground. And just about three. The pitch back to Playsons. Playsons has the first down inside the 10. Touchdown to saving the tackle. Had an opening. And he's quick enough to get through the big hole right there. That and that key block earlier was made by Joel Fontano Amade. He is split out on the left wide wing. Receiver. To the top of your screen, that's Marcus Richardson. Benoit back to throw, fires, end zone, incomplete, and a flag. It'll be first and goal. The interference, David LeBron, the intended right. receiver. Automatic first down. Well, here's the throw. Mm. I mean, Shaquille O'Neal wouldn't have been able to come down first with that one. From the two with the penalty in the end zone. There goes play size, running out to Benoit. Benoit to the end zone. Touchdown, Yale Benoit. Nickel State's first Get touchdown the of the game. Well, Benoit right here get, breaks one tackle, two tackles, takes a lick right at the goal line, able to stick it in. And that was just a gutsy drive Thomas, of the Colonels. Thomas gets hit a couple of times. But Colonels over pursue. He's got enough speed to make it. In his final game of Cowboys tonight he wants some more he wants to he wants to carry it again check that out it was 29 joseph ogletree ogletree with the big hand stick. off to bush chris bush getting to the one yard line apparently they're going to leave bush in there for now with eight minutes to go but play signs with the big hole on there, that first he found down here cowboy uniform this time they'll run the option right play signs takes the pitch from benoit play signs buries his shoulder near first down first down but College football tonight. Here's Playsons. He's going to throw to a wide open receiver. Down the streaking down the far side of the field is Marcus this was, Richardson. You know, they, they tried to run this play earlier in the first drive down near the goal line, but Playsons was sacked. This time, a wide open receiver. Oh, doing a little bit of everything. You know this kid pretty well. Yeah, huh? yeah two out of two on a year for 100 yards, and he's got to get on. Can't want him for Darvis down near the goal line, and right here. Oh. Gets about a 20 yard. Uh, Henry Smith does a heck of a job holding on to this Jay football. Thomas is pretty successful first year, probably beyond his coach. Realm he's the head coach, signed he... a contract extension, and he'll be the coach uh, in Thibodeau for Jim. years to come. Just but everything that had to be going on with that program two weeks before you get to start the season, and, and you lose Daryl Day, a very popular you find head coach. You lose your head coach, and now you got to shuffle the deck with the coaches and promote people and move things around. And you're just trying to keep your head above water. And they went out and had a big win in week one against Eastern Washington and then parlayed uh, into a, what's going to be a 500 State's also series. a school with a lot of players coming back next year. Their entire offensive line comes back as opposed to their quarterback, Benoit, is back. In. In 
three. And an impressive fashion tonight, 30 to nine.